first thing that we need to do is go ahead and adjust the blade, the cutting blade for this. Let's find where we were. And I like to take it down to about three. And that's for cardstock or vinyl, those kinds of things that are a little bit different. And then we're going to go ahead and put it in the collar, lock it in place. And now we're going to load the mat. So we want to place it in here. And you can see there's a prompt on the screen. I don't see, know if you can see it from here, but it says load cutting mat. And we're going to press enter. And it's going to load our cutting mat. And sometimes if you want to adjust the position, you can use the directional arrows here to adjust the position. Sometimes I like to feed in a little bit more, maybe over a little bit. And then we close the lid. And what we're going to do now is go ahead and send the design over to cut on the cardstock first. And we're just cutting a star that's similar to this, but I'm going to show you how it cuts. It's going. Oh, I love how quickly and easily this cuts cardstock, it cuts the iron on vinyl. You can also use uh, the vinyls that they have for uh, bumper stickers. Uh, some people also use that Klingon vinyl to uh, put their initials on stemware, on platters. There's just a whole host of things that you can do with this Cameo cutter in conjunction with the Artistic Suite version 6. Also, you can use the crystal version, you can use the monogram version, a lot depends on where you want to go with it and what you want to do. I like to use the cardstock for making uh, scrapbooks because as you can see, we're going to show you in just a minute some of the shapes that were cut using the Silhouette Cameo Cutter and the Artistic Suite Version 6 software to make the designs for our scrapbook. Okay, now let's take a look and see what we've got. All you need to do is hit enter where it says unload. And we're going to show you. What I like to do is to go ahead and take the base fabric off. I mean to say cardstock. And then you will have a beautiful star finished. I'm just going to fold that back for now so you can see. See how beautiful that cut, nice and clean. Look how beautifully these stars cut. They're just perfect for a scrapbook. You can also cut smaller shapes as well. Let's take a little bit of a look at some of the shapes that I cut for this scrapbook. Look how small that heart turned out. Isn't that just adorable? I love how you could do Look at this one. It's just so teeny. And, of course, everybody loves the hands. These are just some of the different shapes that you can cut using the Silhouette Cameo cutter with the Artistic Suite software. Now, there are other types of uh, materials that you can cut with the Silhouette Cameo as well. What I did do was I cut some iron-on vinyl. And when you cut this, I think I mentioned earlier, you do need to have it in reverse image for when you adhere it because the iron-on is on the back. And now let's take a look. Oh, isn't this adorable? This is so, this came cute. And, and now we have our iron-on vinyl on our little shirt for Clover. Isn't that just too cute? There are so many different things that you can cut with the Silhouette Cameo Cutter and the Artistic Suite Version 6 software. The options are just endless. The only thing stopping you from doing it is you. And now let's get back to looking at the software and what else we can do with it.